What's going on everyone? It's Chris and welcome back for another video. The Lawn Canuck is where people turn to for highly actionable lawn strategies that they can use to improve the look of their lawn. So if that's something that would interest you, subscribe below by tapping that gray icon down in the right hand corner. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you about how to get your lawnmower ready for the first cut of spring. Proper lawnmower maintenance is key in order to improve the longevity of the lawnmower that you do have. Now I always recommend, at least before you cut in the spring for the first time, that you bring your lawnmower out, change your blades, your spark plugs, check your oil, change that also as necessary, and that's what we're going to do here today. I'm going to run through all the steps that you need to do to get your lawnmower up and ready for that all important first cut. Alright, so as you can see here I've got my Toro Super Recycler mower. This mower is now about to go into its fourth season. And the one thing that I really should have done before I put this away for the fall last year is actually clean all this debris out of here. So that's some of the things that we're going to do today. I'm going to take a, um, a leaf blower and blow all that out. And as well, the first thing that we're going to do now here is we're going to go ahead and take out the spark plug. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do here for safety reasons is we're going to take out this little spark plug boot. That way the lawnmower isn't going to start on you unexpectedly if you're going underneath to take the blade off. That would be very dangerous and we don't want anything to happen. So looking in here, your spark plug boot usually is a silver piece under here to start under the engine. Just give it a nice little pull, off that comes. And the next thing we're going to do here, we're going to take that spark plug out as I like to change that once a season. I'm assuming when I pull that out that's going to be uh, pretty burnt out. All right. Over here I've got my little spark plug socket wrench here. I'm going to put the, this end into this, see if this fits. Alright, put the key in there, give that a little turn, give that a spin, pull that out. Let's see what we're working with here. Check that out. That spark plug right here. The burnt end. I knew if I even tried to start this, this probably wouldn't start. This is why we're changing the spark plug at least once a season on the lawnmower. Next thing we're going to do here is we're going to take this oil, we're going to change it out and empty it out. Now I neglected to empty this oil out last year and change it, so it's been about two years since I changed it. That's, a, uh, that's usually not recommended. At least change this oil once a year. Oh yeah, that oil is gonna be that oil is gonna be nice and black. That oil is nice and dark. That was some pretty bad oil. So the next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to tip this lawnmower on the side and I'm going to take off the blade so I can wash it out and clean it out underneath. So I don't know how well this is showing up on camera, but it actually doesn't look as bad as I thought it was going to underneath. I'll end up scraping a lot of this stuff out under here, clean that up, and I take the blade out, scrape this all out, get it all cleaned up, get these leaves that are out of here over here, and then we're almost ready to go. Now I don't have a block of wood to help stop from the blade moving, so I'm going to use my gloves to help protect my hands in case this blade actually moves. So 
So I'll go ahead, I'll put this aside, make sure I keep this bolt here with the cover. Yeah, this blade's not in too bad shape, but I'll be changing it anyway. All right, got a little plastic scraper in here. We're gonna start scraping all the stuff out. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to put the new spark plug back in. So it's important to check what kind of spark plug that you have. You can usually find that on the spark plug itself. So as you can see here, it's got a Champion RL87YC. I've gone to my local lawnmower shop and because I have my information on file, it's pretty easy for them to pull out the correct spark plug for me. Alright, I'm going to put that spark plug in there. Give it a few little turns with my hand. Alright, seems like it's turning okay in there. I know that's pretty hard to see here on the video because my hand's in the way. Got my spark plug wrench over here. Make sure that's in right. Feed that through. Tighten it up. One little turn. And voila. Spark plug's now back on. First things first here. Let's put that spark plug boot back on. There we go. There we go. Let's put the new oil in there now. Throw some gas in it. Let's start it up. All right, I've got my oil here. Make sure you check your owner's manual to make sure what type of oil your engine takes. All right, we'll see if that's enough. All right, let's gas this up and start it. See what we're working with here. Now I had some old gas in there from last year. And the one thing I didn't do that I probably should have done is actually put some fuel stabilizer in the fuel tank because it sat in there all winter. So let's see how it is when we start this up. Alright, we got the leaf blower all started up. Let's clean this up. Put the lawnmower blade back on. Make sure that lines up.
All right, that's all nice and tight. Let's turn it on again and start it right back up. All right, let's put our spark plug boot, spark plug boot back on. All right, we're all ready, let's start. Sounds like a brand new lawnmower to me. Now we're gonna let this run for about five minutes to let the oil circulate through the engine. Then we're gonna go and we're gonna mow. That's gonna be in the next video. There we are, that's it. Now our lawnmower maintenance is done. Now if you're willing to do this on your own, it's probably gonna save you about 90 or $100 as opposed to taking it to a lawnmower place to have it serviced annually. All it takes is an hour of your time or maybe a little bit less and you save yourself some money in the process. Now we're ready to go. If you found this content valuable, please subscribe below in the bottom right hand corner of your screen here by clicking on the gray icon. Until next time, I'm Chris Vale, the Lawn Canuck.